Hello folks, this is Dan Giles coming to you with a Plumbing Fails video. Just a few pictures that I've kind of come up with to show you some fails that I've seen. Teflon tape around the fittings, well, you know, Teflon seals, you know, and that's a short downpipe. These pictures that I'm showing you here, and it's, it's just a few pictures, it's not really anything crazy or outrageous. But uh, it's enough to make you think, you know, it's like what's going through people's minds that would make them do things like they do, you know, like putting this metal nut on this PVC fitting with electrical tape as the sealant on it. We all know that that's not proper and I don't think that people should be doing stuff like this. If you're going to go through all the trouble of doing this, why not go ahead and do it right? It's one of my mottos anyway, you know, if you're not going to do it right the first time, when are you going to have time to go back and do it again? Because this kind of stuff will come back and bite you in the butt. Now I got to say this is pretty ingenious right here. This bucket, e even the handle on the bucket is facing straight forward. This, there's a lot of attention to detail on this. I'm not really sure how long it's going to last, but uh, it's that's it just flat out ingenious right but still, you know, I, I kind of understand where you can't get a tank for that toilet and you got to do something, especially if it's the only toilet in your house. This right here, I don't even, I, I can't begin to understand the reasoning behind this. This is a blender. This is something you're going to make up margaritas and frozen drinks with, you know, and, and that's the garbage disposal they're using as, as a blender. It's actually got wired it's wired coming from the wall into the blender so it's attached to a switch so it's actually being used I don't know if it's smart or dumb but and I'm not really sure here what this is draining into this copper pipe you know maybe it's off the dishwasher I'm not really sure but uh, there's got to be other ways to do it not to mention that flex drain line over on the other side coming out of the garbage disposal. That's, um, you might as well have just put a straight pipe on it. I, I don't understand why. And if somebody really thinks that this is going to stop a flood, you know, a Walmart bag and a, shop, a plastic shopping bag, but it does seem to be holding. I'm not seeing any water around it. But, the things that people do, you know, it's just one of those things. The mother of invention is necessity, or necessity is the mother of invention, however you want to say it. It's not really cool. I don't, I, I don't, just don't understand it. If you're going to use a whole tube of caulking on the base of a toilet, you probably ought to get with DAP and see if you can get some kind of sponsorship. They make things like rags and stuff that you could actually clean that up. But I can't tell you how many times I've seen this situation, especially at gas stations. It's just like, okay, we'll throw some caulk on it. That'll stop it from leaking. And we don't really care what it looks like. Here's a MacGyverism for you here. Some duct tape. Duct tape fixes everything until it starts leaking. I'm not really sure what's hanging off the bottom of that. It almost looks like a, a plastic... I'm not really sure. Is that a grocery bag tied around that and then it's duct taped? The, the level of ingenuity here is, <laughs> it's very poor. You know, again, like I said, if you're not going to do this right, don't do it. My God, this is just, I, my hope is that this is not something that's in somebody's rental home that a maintenance man actually did. I'd be scared to be a maintenance man in the business doing stuff like this. These are just a few pictures I've put together that I've found on the internet and seen on posts and, and some of the groups. Uh, there's a lot more out there that, that can be shown. I may try to find some electricals. And this one has got to take the, this takes the cake. This is truly the throne. You, you really are stepping up and getting above and beyond your work to get up here and do your business. Well, guys, I hope you've enjoyed this. Like I said, my name is Dan Giles. Give me a thumbs up on this if you liked it. 
I'm going to do an electrical video like this pretty soon. So hey, give me a thumbs up, give me a like, and I'll see you soon.